What am I up to? Uh, well, this is my first stream with new uh, branding, uh, new setup. Uh, got some updates on my bot as well to make it a little more intelligent, hopefully. I got a couple of new commands in there. So now we can actually start focusing on the game that we're playing, which is Dark Souls 3. So I've played Demon Souls, Dark Souls 1 and 2, and Bloodborne. So, uh, this is, this is the next one. Let's hope, let's hope it's as, as nice to me as it possibly can be, because I know that it doesn't always like to be. Already the controller wasn't working. Let's see if clicking on it helps. Uh, yep. Okay, cool. New game. Adjust brightness. All the way to the top now. I do like my games a little bit brighter, because uh, I have trouble seeing as it is already, so we'll go with 8. Uh, settings, it's fine. I'm sure, I'm sure the default settings will work perfectly. Yes, indeed. It is called Lothric. Where the transitory lands of the Lords of Cinder converge. In venturing north, the pilgrims discover the truth of the old words. The fire fades, and the lords go without thrones. Well, you can do it, keep going. No. I wonder what they're carrying on their back. When the link of fire is threatened, the bell tolls. Unearthing the old lords of Cinder from their graves. Oh, the lords of Cinder are the ones that linked the flame before. Nice. Gooey. <laughs> I count at least five of them. Nice. Yon the giant. That dude looks menacing. Of, of all of them, he's the scariest looking one to me. Cinder failed, or or became derelict, and now they're they're scraping the bottom of the barrel. We are the last picked kids in gym class, and he's he's laying down. He's cozy. I'm not slapping his butt hard, <laughs> despite the fact you seem to think he needs it. Okay. Uh, name. Okay. Maybe we'll go through the appearance and that'll help me determine what his name should be. Uh, young, mature aged. He seems like he'll be a mature lad. Uh, he can never have. He's, <laughs> he's sleeping. Let him be in peace. He's in his happy place, laying on the desk right next to me. 
I wanted to get like a little like sidecar at one point so that he could be there, but now just having the blanket on my desk, he's pretty cozy. Okay. Uh, oh, it seems to change my starting equipment as well. I'm not going to be the deprived. I'm not. I'm, I'm not metal enough in this game. I. They have different stats as well. Uh, shoot. Okay. Assassin. See, I would go for assassin, but I think. I think I want to go for strength. When I played Bloodborne, I was a dexterity based build, which was fine, but I think that's a lot because I liked the dodging mechanic in Bloodborne more. Uh, I don't know how I'll feel about the dodging mechanic as much in two or in three. So the one that has the highest strength is who cares? <laughs> Isn't it known to be super hard? Yes. Yes, it is. That's what that's what we're here for. <laughs> Just tuck and roll. I don't know. I think I was leaning towards going for a strength build. So the question... Because Assassin is only a 10 strength and a 14 dexterity. But if I do Warrior, I get 16 strength, but only 9 dexterity. I could go for something more middle of the line, but if I'm going strength build, I should just go for the strength. I mean, Knight seems pretty well balanced in general. What is the Knight lacking in? Luck? I do like luck. Oh, attunement? I don't know what attunement is. And vitality? I don't know, I think I'm leaning towards warrior right now. Burial gift. Oh, I get a gift? Raises max HP, fully restores HP. Is that like a single use though? What is the last one? The deprived? The deprived has nothing. It's just a flat 10 across the board for everything and gets a club and a wooden shield. They've had they had that in Dark Souls 1 too. It's like the like uh the starting it off yeah, hard mode basically. I don't think it actually makes the game any harder. Okay, but the divine blessing and the hidden blessing seem to be just like single use items from what I can tell. A fire bomb's also a single use item, the fire gem. A lot of these are just single use items. So maybe I'll just go with the life ring for now, because that's the only like permanent upgrade that I'll get. And I'm really bad with using my consumables. I am here for the hard game. I've, I've played a few of the Souls games now. Okay, let's see. Am I going, what, what kind of, what kind of bot, large head? <laughs> All right, yeah, big head. I only have one way to go. <laughs> you make a compelling argument, I'm not going to lie. His eyes look like they're a little too close together. He, this one looks too handsome. That's the steely look of determination. Maybe I should go with that one to start with. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> No, no, well, it can go in a little bit, but the rest of that. <laughs> Why am I making him so weird when I can have the handsomest warrior to walk the earth? I already do that every day in real life. I, I am blessed with this face. And so I need, I need to see how the other, how the other side lives, right? I want to, I want to relate to you on a, an emotional level, Elena. Nose protrusion. Someone quote that. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Why can't I just leave him alone? <laughs> uh, he can smell your sins, man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, save to favorites. He is my favorite. He's beautiful. 
<laughs> the man himself. All right, now we need a name. A man needs a name. What are we gonna call him? The first name that came to my mind was Armando. Thoughts? Trash? Hey, hey, come on. <laughs> oh, is that your dad's name? <laughs> Chin? Chi Chi Chin? Maybe not Armando then. Don't need, don't need to. He needs to be unique. Uh. Hmm. Like I called the one with the huge nose honk. I think I'm just gonna, I think I'm gonna name him my best friend. <laughs> Cause he's my best friend. He and I, we're gonna get along. There's going to be no, I'm not gonna be yelling at him for dodging the wrong way at any point. Uh, we go to the gym together and he never does leg day with me, which is fine because we are always doing uh, chest and arm day together. It's fine. <laughs> Squonk. <laughs> He's my best friend. All right. We've put off the pain long enough. We've spent, we, I, it's a, I, I'm a half hour into my stream and I haven't even started the game. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, yeah, no, we're best friends. Well, there will be no animosity between the two of us. Oh, no, I just realized that uh, he might be hollow. <laughs> Is he going to look different when he's hollow? Oh, shit. Here we go again. No, he, he looks... He looks like himself. He looks great. I'm so pleased with this. Okay. I need to get used to the controls again. <laughs> I need to get used to the controls again, mostly because I am now using a weird controller that uh, switched some of the face buttons. <laughs> It's all right. The bot is, uh, there's always, there's always a delay between the stream. The bot's actually pretty instant. Okay. And two-handing is that button. Uh, let me just drink an Estus flask right away. I don't need it. Strong attack. Target. Hey there, buddy. We're friends, right? Ah, shit. <laughs> okay. No, we're not friends. Got him. First kill. It's gone. We're, we're on a roll. First of many. All right. Which way do I go? Oh, over here. Looks like there's somebody chilling out, having a good time. Can I jump? Dusty. Dusty. I think I just realized that the, the bot is kind of it. Like, sorry. One sec. I, there are technical difficulties in the stream. The bot jumps behind the chat box, and I think I want to change that. I think I would like it if, like, the toasty image would come in front of the chat. So I just, I just switched that. Ashen Estes Flask? Is that a cat? It's Bob. Baba, uh, his favorite place to be is as close to me as possible. <laughs> it's a rat. Sometimes it feels like it. Okay, critical hit. Oh shit, a rat. Hi there, friend. Do you mind if I just murder you? Bam. See, we're already wrecking it. We're doing great. Me and my best friend, we're going on an adventure together. What? <laughs> I was watching how somebody else died, not how I die. <laughs> Okay, I can kill these guys in one hit. Where's the threat? I don't see a threat. Except for me. <laughs> I 
what was that? I pressed LT and it, he just started screaming. It made my blue bar go down. Okay, there's there's a bunch of paths to take and I don't like it. Turn back. No. I'm just waiting for like a boulder to get dropped into the ravine here to kill me. Oh, hi there, friend. Too bad I already have a best friend. All right, I, I'm, I'm going to check that in a second. Let me exhaust all other possible avenues before we go deal with the big shiny boy. Ooh, there's so much jingle jangling when you move, man. Is it the chain link on you? I don't... That looks like the way out. I'm very indecisive, by the way, when it comes to this kind of stuff. Bam! Oh, I can kick? Yeah, there's, there's, there's the commands. I'm pretty sure that's all of them. I did update that. Okay, LT is to parry. Oh, that's parrying? LT? Wait. Somebody just laying there dead against the cup. Yeah, Elena took the, the hill and nobody took it from her. Alright, I think I can go down this way. Although, is this going to lead me around where the big guy was? No, okay. It's, uh, you gotta add a space between quote and the number. Alright, we're gonna go deal with the big guy. I'm not seeing anything else. I'm hoping the new additions to the botter go over well. I guess we'll see how it, how it turns out. All right, big guy. I'm. This is gonna be fine. Is he? Did he just? Is he Sonic? <laughs> He's covered in crystal. Oh, he's got a good amount of health on him too. All right, this is gonna be this is gonna be rough. I don't like your your Sonic the Hedgehog rolling. And the, the way he like stalks at me. Woo. Hello there. Hello there. Okay, we're doing we're doing great. We're under control. We dodged the, the sonic roll. Wah! Okay, he does a lot of damage when he actually hits you. Can I take some sip? Okay. Titanite scale, which if uh, 
Dark Souls 1 tells me anything, that's for upgrading my weapons. Soul of an Unknown Traveler. I only got I only got hit once there, which was enough to almost kill me. <laughs> but hey, we're off to a great start. Me and my best friend, we're never going to die. We're, this is a zero death run of Dark Souls 3. First time playing blind playthrough zero death run. You you've never never seen it before. World first. Okay. <laughs> Like in before I just immediately fall right off the cliff. How do you die, my friend? It looks like you just kind of rolled right off. <laughs> Zero death run. Ah, oh, we found our first bonfire, see? We're doing great. That looks nice. That actually does look nice. Mountains. Oh. Oh. That is a large, like, castle. That I was right on the outside of. The jump. <laughs> what part of zero death run? Ah! We got an achievement. I'm covering it. Because it's the one corner I found that didn't have anything. But I got an achievement for, uh... For lighting my first bonfire. Wait, why do I still only have one Estus flask? Oh, it's because I have to actually sit at the bonfire too. Okay, got it. That would that would do it. Hey there. I hope you're enjoying the videos of the Dark Souls 3 adventure with me and my best friend. I'd love to hear what you all think, so please leave a like or a comment and consider subscribing to follow my journey to beat as many games as I can. Thank you for taking the time to watch, and I'll see you in the next one.